We are here with Baldwin Wallace after an opening round thrilling victory over RIT, a come from behind win. Uh, if you would, ladies, would like to just start by introducing yourselves from left to right, and uh, Coach, we'll start with an opening statement for you. Um, I'm Kara Marshall. I'm a junior. Sherry Hare, best, uh, Baldwin Wallace, my son, my head coach. Hell yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm Lily Edwards. I'm a freshman. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, um, boy, what a game. I, as much as I'm excited for our kids for winning, I, I'm heartbroken for RIT, too, because they played incredibly well. Um, you look at, uh, yeah, number one went three of three from the three-point line, and none of those were easy looks. And kids that don't normally hit a lot of threes, they, they played extremely well. And uh, it's just fortunate that our kids battled back. I'm so proud of these guys. When things weren't going well earlier this year, that kind of snowballed on us. And um, I think we learned through the grind of the OAC that you just keep battling. And um, fortunately, it was enough tonight. Yeah, great coach. Players' perspective, you guys down double digits in the fourth quarter. Uh, what's the mindset out there? Obviously, you guys battled back, but it wasn't for uh, a few minutes into that fourth quarter that uh, you guys started really jumping into that lead and, uh, and cutting into it. What's the mindset as a, as a group out there, as a unit on the floor? Uh, I think that kind of sums up our season a lot of the time. You know, last week we lost in a big game, and we thought our season was over. And it, here we are now. We have to battle back and prove ourselves. And we just really came together as a unit tonight, and it was a great time. We just have a big emphasis on our team about making sure that we're loving <coughs> each other all throughout the game. Um, we, have a positive, we have a positive attitude on and off the floor, and it is absolutely what carried us through the end. Yeah. Coach? From your perspective, you guys, a lot of runs in that game. Went up big early on, uh, RIT battled back, took the lead kind of in the midpoint of that game, and then you guys finishing strong, obviously. Consistency throughout the year, throughout the, the game today, what's the, uh, what's the message to your team throughout a contest like that? Well, uh, if you look at our history this year, we were up 23 in the first half on somebody and lost. And we were up 15 at halftime on somebody and lost. Um, so I think we figured out throughout the year that game's never over until the buzzer goes. And fortunately, this time we were on the right, the correct <laughs> side of that. But uh, these guys have grown so much. We talk a lot about body language and a positive attitude and picking each other up. And um, thankful that they've listened to that. And it really has made a difference for us. Final shot of the game. Obviously a big one for you guys. Um, what's the conversation in the huddle? You guys draw that up, obviously, and uh, execution. What's going through your brain when that's uh, the shots going up and plays developing? Um, my I think what gave me confidence at the very end was my teammates were in my ear telling me that they love me no matter what, and I knew that if if we got the pass off, it was going to go in. We were going to pull it out. I had full confidence in my teammates. Riley Shill threw an amazing pass to me, and um, it was just a, it was a good play. And we kept our heads up. We didn't freak out in the moment. We're less than 24 hours from game two of this weekend for you guys. Mindset going in from a player's perspective. Uh, next 24 hours, what's it look like? Uh, we got to enjoy it tonight, and then when we go to shoot around tomorrow, it's on the next team. So just get prepared. Coach, final question for you. What's the 24 hours look like from a coaching perspective to get ready for uh, either Messiah or Hilbert, depending on how things go in our next game here? Not a lot of staff sleep. It'll be up watching a lot of video. We watched a little bit, but not very much. Um, Coach Hartzler is probably going to take the, the majority of that. He's, he's uh, our scout guy, but, um, yeah, I don't sleep anyway, so I might as well watch film, right? Um, but really just trying to figure out how to put these guys in the best position to play as well as we can tomorrow. Fantastic. Congratulations on a round one win. We'll see you tomorrow afternoon. Thank you so much.